What's going on everybody, War right here, bringing you another Warframe video. Today we're going to be focusing on good old Hildren. Tanky, beginner friendly, nice and easy to use. If you want to see more of these vi videos, go ahead and hit that sub button on your way out. Hit that like button, helps the channel a lot. But uh, I really love Hildred. She's a lot of fun, super tanky. Um, fairly easy to use, uh, quite versatile, does a lot of damage. Um, helps the teammates. She's just an overall really good frame. Uh, she gets a lot done for you. She makes life really easy for you. Um, it's just a super, super good Warframe. I think it's a little underrated Warframe, to be honest. I don't think she gets enough credit, so we're going to hopefully shine some light on that. And maybe you guys can kind of see what you can do with her. Now, some of this gameplay footage you're seeing is basically... I was just focusing on using the Balefire uh, Chargers, her... her her main weapon um you can see it's 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 doing a lot of work it's real easy um really no problems you know some of the pros that we do find with her she is extremely tanky uh good damage and very beginner friendly she's very easy to use and very easy to stay alive with uh, some of the cons i'd say is acquiring her is kind of a pain you got to do a lot of you know new stuff farming so for for a very very early game it might be a little difficult uh, shield management can become a little difficult at times, and I don't know how endgame viable she'll end up being for some of you. Now, obviously, every frame has its potential to shine in any particular situation if built right. Uh, I haven't done a lot of testing on the the endgame uh, material with her, but you know, as you can see here, I mean, this is a wave 37 defense, and I was still not really shooting anything besides the bubbles. So she does a really good job with mid-tier uh, content. So for us beginners, for, for you guys out there that are still trying to learn some of the game, get through some of the star chart, the sooner you can get Hildren, the better. She's going to do a lot of good work for you overall. It's really nice to have. Um, you know, there's probably better out there. Absolutely. There's definitely worse out there, though. So, you know, we're going to kind of show you some stuff. Um we're going to go ahead and look at a couple builds that you can definitely try. Uh, the build that you're going to see here up next is what I was running and all you saw. Uh, a little bit of a focus here. So you got your bale fire, which is basically just a hand cannon. Uh, pillage is going to steal shields. Uh, focusing with efficiency, range, and strength with all these abilities. Uh, Haven is going to actually be where you're going to be buffing your teammates. You're also going to be buffing your own. Uh, and her four is just the Aegis Storm, which is, I don't use it a lot, but it definitely comes in really super handy. Um, as you can see the build here, this is what I was running in the footage you saw there. Loot Detector, Redirection, Viger, Prime Continuity, Stretch, Intensify, Blind Rage, Augur Reach, and Augur Message. And I'm going to also show you here another option that you could go with, with Corrosive Projection, Redirection, Gladiator Aegis. Streamline, Fleeting Expertise, Transient Fortitude, Augur Reach, Stretch, and Intensify. These are just a couple examples of things you could definitely go with and have a really good time. Uh, this next build is just your basic Bale Fire. Um, it, you know, just putting up as much damage as you can. And I'll show you what I did here. I got this thing up to 35,000 radiation. Not a lot lives with 35,000 radiation. It does a lot of work for you. So that's a good start for you. And you're not going to have any real issues with much content. Um, like I said, up until mid to late game, really. And even then, if you play her right and you, you, you learn to manage the shields, you learn to manage your, your, your energy, which is your shields, um, it's, it's super nice. Like, you know, not having to worry about energy drain. You, you, can, you can balance your, your abilities to keep regenerating your shields, which is regenerating your energy. Uh, really comes in super handy. There's not a lot of downtime if you don't want it. Uh, Hildren itself is just, like I said, overall a really good frame for anybody starting out the game. Uh, good frame, I suggest anybody to pick up because she's an absolute Corpus killer, as you can see here. Corpus just gets shredded because of their shields. So, do me a favor. If you like what you see, go ahead and hit that sub and like. I uh, appreciate everybody coming out, hanging out. Thank you so much for watching. That's going to do it for me. War out.